Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Have you ever found yourself staring at a blank page, feeling completely uninspired and stuck in a creative rut? Well, you're not alone. But don't worry because today, we're diving into some strategies to help you overcome that dreaded creative journaling slump and reignite your inspiration. Let's get started. Tip number one, explore new techniques. Sometimes, all it takes is trying out new techniques to get those creative juices flowing. Experiment with different journaling styles. For example, if your usual style of journaling is using stickers and washi tapes, you can try other creative journaling techniques like collaging, mixed media, doodling, journaling with photos, and ephemera. Stepping outside of your comfort zone can reignite your creativity. Also, when trying out new techniques, embrace imperfection and allow yourself to make mistakes along the way. Sometimes, we feel stuck because we want to copy exactly other people's journaling pages, and we feel frustrated when the final output didn't turn out the way we wanted. Remember, there's no such thing as perfect journal. Your journal is a reflection of your unique journey, so don't be afraid to let go of expectations and just have fun with it. Sometimes, a change of scenery can do wonders for sparking new ideas. Try journaling in a different location, like a cozy coffee shop, a peaceful park, in your garden, or even your backyard. Take your journaling outside of your usual space and let the new environment stimulate your senses. The new sights, sounds, and smells can provide fresh inspiration. Inspiration is all around us if we take the time to look for it. Pay attention to the little details in your everyday life, like a colorful flower, the books you've read, or the shows you've watched. Use these observations as prompts for your journaling adventures. Tip number three, use prompts or writing exercises. If you're struggling to come up with something to write about, try using journaling prompts or writing exercises Look for social media hashtags dedicated to journaling prompts or creative challenges. There are also many resources online like on Pinterest or blogs and in books that offer creative prompts to get you started. These can provide you with a starting point or a new direction to explore in your journal, helping you break free from creative stagnation. In my traveler's notebook, I have a specific insert filled with journaling prompts that I can easily refer to whenever I'm feeling stuck or need inspiration. Tip number four, revisit old entries for inspiration. Sometimes, looking back at your previous journal entries can spark new creative ideas or perspectives. Reflect on how you've grown or how your thoughts and feelings have evolved over time. You might find inspiration in revisiting old memories or exploring how your journaling style has changed. Tip number five, take a break. If you're feeling truly stuck, it's okay to take a break from journaling for a little while. Step away and allow yourself to recharge and refocus. Whenever I'm feeling stuck, I engage in my other hobbies like reading books, traveling or exploring new places, trying out new food, and watching new movies and series. I notice that after a break, when I return to my journal, I find that my creative well has been refilled. Journaling should be an enjoyable practice and not a chore, so don't be afraid to step away and do other activities that bring you joy. Remember, creative ruts are temporary and perfectly normal. By trying new approaches, seeking inspiration from different sources, and being patient with yourself, you can overcome these slumps and reignite your passion for journaling. So don't be discouraged, keep exploring, experimenting, and most importantly, have fun with the process. 
I would love to know what do you do when you're experiencing a journaling slump. Share your strategies in the comments below. Thanks for joining me today. Happy journaling!